Women are fickle, illogical, and driven by emotions. Men are steady, cold and driven by logic. At least that's the common stereotype. But research shows that, in contrast to popular belief, women are not more emotional than men. Feelings such as enthusiasm, nervousness, or strength are often interpreted differently depending on the gender of the person experiencing them. The new study results counter this bias. For example, a man whose emotions fluctuate during a sporting event is described as passionate. However, a woman whose emotions change as a result of any event, even if provoked, is considered irrational. According to the study's senior author Adrian A. Belts, assistant professor of psychology at the University of Michigan. Belts and colleagues followed 142 men and women over 75 days to learn more about their daily emotions, both positive and negative. They divided the women into four groups, one naturally cycling and three others using different forms of oral contraceptives. The researchers detected fluctuations in emotions three different ways, and then compared the men and the women. They found little to no differences between the men and the various groups of women, suggesting that men's emotions fluctuate to the same extent as women's do, although likely for different reasons. They also didn't find meaningful differences between the groups of women, making clear that emotional highs and lows are due to many influences, not just hormones. According to the researchers, the findings have far-reaching implications. Women have historically been excluded from research participation due to the assumption that ovarian hormone fluctuations cause variation, particularly in emotion, that cannot be controlled experimentally. The study uniquely provides psychological data to show that the justifications for excluding women in the first place, namely, that fluctuating ovarian hormones, and consequently emotions, confounded experiments were misguided assumptions by a medical, neurological, and social scientists should adjust their conceptual and statistical assumptions accordingly.